go. This is watching because you want to know. My name is AJ, and uh, I was just looking for some cows. So there are a couple of cows out there because that's what we're going to be needing this episode. Um, I've done this. I've done quite a few stuff off camera. So I'm going to go through first what we've done off camera. We've got the uh, elevator here. We've got the minecart elevator. Oh, and someone was saying, or a few people were saying, use boats. They're cheaper. Uh, yeah, we could use boats. They are a lot cheaper, obviously, than, than minecarts, but they don't look as cool, do they? Minecarts look cooler than boats do. Uh, but I've also got a dead drop here, which I haven't tested. I've literally just done it. Hopefully we'll be okay. Oh, we're fine. Whew. <laughs> I was a little nervous about that. Lucky it's not hardcore. So yeah, so I can get down quickly and then we can use the elevator to get up. But this is all I have on me because uh, I died a few more times <laughs> after last episode uh, with that love of sorting out the, um, uh, what do you call it, the XP spawner. This has changed a little bit, I think, from where you last saw it. I've dug all this out, made it a little bit wider, made it a little bit more roomy. Uh, I've got my storage chests here, we've got the crafting table still. That's where the crafting table was last episode. So I've dug out like three blocks wide there. I've dug out little bits of things here and there for like future projects and stuff like that, future ideas. I've got the staircase going down. Uh, I've fixed the mob XP grinder. We, we built this last episode, but it wasn't quite perfect. It wasn't... Bang on the money. Here they are. I can hear them now. It wasn't bang on the money. All the redstone was exactly right. And I've got this door to out the back here in case I ever want to change anything. So, very, very quickly, as a recap from last episode, uh, this repeater is on maximum delay. And this repeater is on one tick off maximum. That's the easiest way to describe it. And then this is just a sticky piston um, underneath that cobblestone block facing upwards. And to fix it to a one block, uh, a one hit uh, kill... I just increased it to a five block drop instead of a four block drop. Last episode I done a four block drop and it was like two hits to kill them. Uh, well hopefully now, and I just got this redstone here just to make it a little bit easier for me to pick the lever. There we go. And hopefully now this should be, I've tested it two or three times <laughs> and uh, it, it was a one hit kill. So I'm just praying that on demonstration to you guys it's going to be a one punch kill. Let's get that out of my hand. Uh, they do fall through still. I'm not quite sure how. I had another look up them. There's no way they can get through. They just must push each other and glitch through. Uh, he died. That's annoying. Does that open that door? Uh, it might do. Yeah, but it will. <laughs> oh well. That doesn't matter. Um, let's just try once more and then I'm going to leave. I'm going to move on. But this is all we have. I have no tools or nothing like that. It all died and it all died in lava. Here we go. Look. There we go. Okay, so it works fine. Nice little XP grinder there for when we need it. And it's right at the beginning of our base. So there should always be stuff spawning, or pretty much all the time. But uh, let's first make some iron tools. Now we're going to need a lot of iron this episode. And we're going to need some wood. Um, yeah, let's just start off with some iron tools. And some iron armor is for definite, because uh, I'm tired of having no armor. So there's some iron, tool, uh, iron armor. And then... Boop, 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 boop. Iron tools. I would really like all the iron tools I could possibly have. Dog barking. No, you're fine. Shut up, dog. Okay, so let's put this iron on. Now, uh, we're going to use a lot of iron this episode because here I'm going to put a cow farm. Uh, we're, we're super low on food. This is all the food that I have left. Everything else is really bad. I might have a couple of apples and stuff like that. Uh, but we're going to work on this. And it's going to be a really cool idea. I wanted just something a little bit funny for, for a normal cow farm. So we're going to have cows up the top there, we're going to have dispensers up the top there, and some pistons up the top there. And the dispensers are going to dispense out water to push the cows down here into some lava. Uh, I need to go and get the lava by the way. But uh, we need to make some dispensers first. So let's get all the stuff ready for some dispensers. I have gone round and collected up as much string as I could be bothered to get. I think we've got enough. We need uh, 12, 12 bows, which means we're going to need 12 dispensers. So, 12 bows. We should be able to do it. I think I've got enough string, haven't I? Yeah, definitely. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then we need to make the dispenser, which is just with some redstone and some cobblestone. So, we need to make 12 of these. It's crazy, isn't it? Right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. We're going to need some more redstone, though. Uh, I don't know if we've even got enough redstone to do all of this. Okay, we're going to need to have 12 pistons as well. Uh, normal pistons, not sticky pistons. I would use sticky pistons. Oop, burp. I would use sticky pistons if I had enough uh, slime balls. 
but I've only got eight left. I've just had a st sausage roll, so I've got like a little hiccupy indigestion at the minute. It's a lovely sausage roll, though. It's a brilliant sausage roll. Okay, so how do we make a piston again? We need... We've got the cobblestone. Let's get some more cobblestone. We're probably going to need a little bit more wood. We've got the redstone. We've got the iron. We should be good. So 12 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. Redstone is got... Uh, signs. 12 si No. 12. 24 signs we need. We're going to need some more wood, aren't we? Probably. Okay. 24 signs. I don't know how much... <laughs> how many sticks that is. Not very good with this whole math stuff. Okay. Uh, 16. 20. That, that's enough, isn't it? Okay. Let's put these signs down first. And then that'll stop me from getting killed later on. So let's get these and these down. Now we're going to place these signs on this level here. Yeah. So three blocks up. We've got two to walk in. Then a sign and the lava on top. And then the lava's not going to like accidentally kill us if we accidentally jump or something like that. So they're going to go along that side. And then I'm going to have glass. I need to smell of some glass because I'm going to have this as a glass front. And we'll have the signs on the other side there as well. Okay. So now let's go up here. And place down our, our other stuff that we've got. So this is the staircase up here that I'll use to breed the cows with. And to get in and out, I've put a little trap door here so I can I can get in and out and the cows can't. Which is very, very handy. So we're going to place these 12 dispensers down. 1, 2, uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. And then around the back here... Uh, on here, we can place our redstone like this. Nice and simple. Not doing anything complicated with the redstone yet. We're just going to have it like that. We might need to repeat it there. But it would, no, it should go 12 blocks. It should be fine. So we've got the, the dispensers here. And these are going to dispense out a bucket of water each. I've got some buckets. I just need to go and get some lava first. And then we'll fill up the rest with buckets. And then here, I'm going to put uh, the pistons. So, uh... This is actually going to leave a one block gap uh, underneath. So baby cows are actually going to be able to be pushed through or walk through. Now they shouldn't too much. If they do it too much and it is too much of a concern and it's um, actually affecting the efficiency of the farm uh, a certain amount that I'm not happy with, then we'll just put another row of pistons down here. But basically these pistons are going to come down to hold the cows in when we're not killing them, when we're not, when we're not, murdering them uh, but we do need to get on top of here Ugh. we do need to get on top of here and uh, I don't know where it is <laughs> and place a redstone line down let's just poke a hole through here should be somewhere there okay there it is and we go up here and we've got to go the last thing we've got to do is then go up and go and find some uh, some cows <laughs> there are there were there were, there were two up there okay so we need to get above here Let's um, let's just go up here for now. I will neaten all this up later. Don't worry about it. We just need to sort of get up there first. Um, this is harder than it looks. <laughs> right up here. I dug out as much as I could, so we we done as little sort of digging off camera as possible. I have no idea. Is it here? Nope. Is it here? Nope. Oh, I don't know, do I? It could be there. Yeah, it is here. Okay, this is the road that we need. Let's uh, get that cobblestone back down. Huh. Put that there. Is there one below here? Yes, there is. Is there one below there? No, there isn't. Okay, so it starts here. So that's one... Let's get a torch as well. Oh, no, I ain't got any torches on me. Damn it. Uh, <laughs> I literally just died before I started recording. One, two, three. I can't see nothing. I'm going to need a torch. Ugh. Down here. Uh, no torches. Have I got any torches anywhere? Probably not. Let's make some more anyway. Whoop. And got some stuff on me already. There we go. 32 will do for now. Jump back up here. Hup, hup, hup. Uh, uh, uh. This is the most dodgiest staircase you have ever seen in your life. Right. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11, can't see anything, 12, I think that got it, 
Okay, so we should dig down here and there should be nothing there. Perfect. And there should be something there. Excellent. When you count right, you feel good. Okay, so let's put the redstone along here. And this is just power all those pistons. Oh, by the way, uh, if you do want the dimensions for this, it's very, very simple. Uh, this is 12 blocks long or wide, whatever you want to call it, by 8 blocks. Because 8 blocks is how far water pushes. So the water will actually stop on the end block here. Uh, so they fall down. So if you want to do it yourself, uh, 12 by 8. Or you can make it any size you want. I'm just doing it 12 by 8. In the one that I've done on the test world to see if this would work. I think it was about sort of 15 or 16 by 8. But we don't really need it that big. We can always extend it. It's easy to extend. You just build out one way, uh, whatever way you want. <coughs> okay. So I've got some buckets. I'm going to go and collect some lava. Uh, so we can get this lava bit in. And I'm going to smelt up some sand as well. Uh, in fact, we can probably go and get some sand together. In fact, we're doing alright for time. We can go get some sand together. Hup. And up the top. Lovely quick elevator here. I need to move our bed down here. I might make another bed first and then, and then sleep in it and then destroy that one. So at least we've still got our spawn. Yeah, there's loads of cows here. That's nice to see. Our sugar cane is growing so we can get some enchanting done soon. Fairly soon. Um, just need to sort of wait until it's fully grown. I want a full stack of bookshelves. I don't know what a pansy about with low level enchantments. Uh, but we need some sand. Where's my map? Oh no, I died and I haven't got my map. Um... Bum, 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 bum. There's got to be. There was pretty much every biome around us, wasn't there? So we've got snow biome. Is that a desert biome there? That is. I see a cactus out in the distance. We've got some sand here as well. I don't really want to dig up sand that's right by my house, so you never know. We might we might pretty fire up this area. I tell you what, though, it is lovely living underground. The amount of resources just so readily available. No need to go caving or nothing like that. It's just all there, all ready for you to take. And uh, you just easily mine it. If you run out of coal, you just sort of dig a little bit, dig around a bit, and you'll find enough coal to be able to smoke whatever you need. It's really, really nice. I've never never lived in an underground house before, but I'm glad we've tried it. And we've got a jungle here as well. Excellent. Looks like we've got a sort of a perfect location with all the biomes around us, which is very handy. So, how many, how much glass are we going to need? Use? We're going to need full blocks, not panes, because we're going to put signs on them. Uh, six will make... Oh, no, it's one each, isn't it? It's, it's one sand for one glass block. So, 12, 24. What's, tw what's 12 plus 24? Uh, 36. We need 36. Okay, that'll do then. Alright. Okay. <laughs> I spent so long doing the maths, I had too much in the end. Okay, it's got, oh, that's a cool little hole. Look at that little hole there. It's even got some coal in it. I like that little hole. Need to light up all this area as much as possible, really, because... Uh, it's going to affect our spawn rates when we start doing more complicated mob traps. We will be doing some really cool mob traps eventually. I think we can get home this way. Oops. Pretty sure that we should come out sort of directly in front of our house. It's a pretty cool cave though. If I could get out, it'd be a really cool cave. There it is. I found it. I found it. Don't worry, guys. Okay, we're down to two beef. That's crazy. All right. So, uh, yeah, let me go and get some lava. I'll just like... Go into that mine cut mine shop. Oh yeah, I found a really easy lava pool while looking for iron. Ah, it was right by um, about four diamonds as well. Uh, so yeah, I should go to that easy pool and I shall be right back. Ooh, an egg. All right, guys, smelted up the glass, got some buckets of lava. I don't know if we got too much. I just bought all the buckets I had. So <laughs> let's put this glass down. Then we can get the other row of lava. Oh, should we put the lava in last? No, we should put the lava in now. Okay, so let's. Uh, otherwise, I've got to make some more buckets. Let's put this glass down like this. This will all be pretty dope. This won't be stone forever, you know. This will be, um, I don't know, like quartz and stuff. I don't know, wood. Uh, it's going to look really, really nice. Just at the moment, it looks very cave-like. Uh, but it won't look all cavey for, for long, hopefully. I do want to sort of get a move on and start making this look prettier. It's just sort of getting the necessities like food set up. <laughs> two, two pork chop left. And... Uh, and yeah, it's, it's not the greatest, not the greatest setup in the world. Okay, so let's put this lava down now. Now, let's um, stick some stuff away. Have I got something that I can just like bung some stuff in? Yeah, let's just bung some stuff in here. Like, the, Oh no, not lava bucket. I want lava bucket. Uh, no, uh, egg. Go away, egg. That can go away. Hiccups. Okay, that'll do. Just to get some stuff, some free inventory space. Get these lava buckets. Now, we don't need to use all of these up if we don't need to, but we're just going to place there and just use as little as possible if we can, really. 
there. There, we might as well use them all up because we're going to need the buckets anyway. Uh, it's nervous. Right below lava, you know. It's not fun. Okay, so we've got a nice lava blade here. So the cows will fall through here, um, be cooked. We won't get any XP from it, but we will get cooked puk cork chop. <laughs> cooked pork chop off the bat. So uh, that'd be really nice. We won't have to sit around and, and let it cook and stuff. Okay, so <laughs> let's put some glass down. Okay, we're going to leave a gap of two at the end there. We'll put a door on so we can actually walk in here. I like having glass so we can sort of see through it. It's going to look really, really cool. So let's get some water now. Uh, we're going to need 12 buckets. I have got, th I think, three more. How many is this going to be? This is going to be, that's eight buckets, isn't it? Yeah, eight buckets. And then nine, ten, eleven. Let's just make one more freaking bucket, shall we? Let's just make a bucket. And then we've got 12. Uh... Bucket, 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 bucket. I always forget where the silly things are in the game. There we go. Okay, and put this iron back for now. Let's go and grab some water. And uh, we're going to need some repeaters as well. Uh, I think I've still got some smooth stone. Uh, no, no, I'm falling. I need to find an easy way to get out of these. There we go. I need to just head towards the wall where the ladder is. Okay, it's night time. Let's get the sword ready. Just in case. Just in case. I think we're fairly safe. How are we get? <laughs> I think you just heard the Simpsons game. Uh, at least we haven't... Uh, what was I going to say? I can't remember what I was going to say now. That damn Homer Simpson disturbing me. Any more buckets? No. Um, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, I don't know how I'm going to get the cows down here. That's going to be a, a tricky one. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if they'll... Will they survive the dead drop? They should do. If I do, they should. Mind you, they're not one block wide... Though, are they? Yeah, they are, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They should. They might do. They might do. We need some wheat, actually. Ooh. Need some wheat to get them down here. Okay, I'll worry about that later. I'll worry about that later. We can get those. We can get wheat grown in a moment. We've got some bones, so, yeah. Absolutely fine. Um, So, we're going to go down here. And we're going to put the water in this. One in each one. Now, I know you don't need to have as much dispensers and stuff as what I've got here. I'm just doing it the way I like to do it. I'm doing it the fun way. I, you know, I, oops, not a sword. I just dispense a sword at the cows. You know, there's, there's different ways to do certain things. But I'm trying to keep my redstone, at the moment at least, at the beginning, as simple as possible. So people that are trying to build the stuff themselves uh, can easily do so. Okay, so we've got that in. I've got that there. I've got the two redstone control uh, wires. Now, well, not wires. I've got the channels. So we're going to have one wire coming down here to there uh, oh no to there and then the other one gone from there so i can actually put a block there to remind me not to go down that way there we go perfect and a torch would be very very nice Boop. okay and then the other one is from the pistons up there and they just go overhead and then they go down there and then the controls will be down here so we're going to have one lever for the pistons one button for the dispensers at the back there so now we've got those in, it's a matter of hooking up the redstone, isn't it? I can't see what would what else we'd need. Okay, what redstone stuff have I got? Have I got any stuff left over? I don't think so. Right, we've got some smooth stone though. Whoops. S smooth stone. And i got all the redstone I have on me. That's not good. Need to do some more caving. Okay, redstone is really hard to come by. That's any trouble. One, two, three, four. Oh, I don't know. We're really going to need... Two repeaters, at least. Yeah, two repeaters should be good. We're going to need a few redstone torches to do our vertical wiring. Uh, we're going to probably need a little bit more than ten. In fact, uh, have I got no wood on me? I've got no wood on me. Uh, wood. Uh, torch. Everything. I'm going to have torches everywhere because I keep accidentally placing them. Okay. Add uh, sticks. I hope you guys can follow this because I think it's a pretty cool design. Okay, 16 will do. We should be able to get there with 16. So what we're going to do is we're going to have... Ah, ah, I can't see. Um, redstone. Redstone. Redstone, redstone. And then if I can get in here... Let's um, do this side first, shall we? No, let's do the other side first because then we can get back across again. Okay, so knock a hole through here. And we're going to have a block... Oh, this is going to be hard, isn't it? We're going to have to dig up to the side, aren't we? Yeah, damn it. Okay. Uh, 
At least we can see a bit more now. Get some more light done. Okay, this isn't too bad. It's not it's not far. So we have that. Then a torch. Then up. Then there. Then a torch. This is just a, a nice a simple way to wire. It's just straight up, you see. Okay, and we need to hook up to here. So we're going to have that there. Um, we don't need that there, do we? If we have it just like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Perfect. Okay. So then for the reds, for the repeater, where's our dispenser? That's not... Where's our dispenser start? Dispenser start there. If we had a dispenser right here, uh, a repeater right there, it should reach the whole way. It should be good. We'll test it in a minute. Okay. And then if we come here... Ah, torch. We should be able to dig down here and do our other one. Careful. Block. That. Up. There. Hup. 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 Nice and simple. Simple redstone, guys. Nothing too complicated. There. We've seen it go up higher. Don't use smooth stone. I don't really want to use smooth stone for building at the minute. <laughs> uh, get up there. Boop, 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 boop. Excellent. And then if we put a repeater here, it should get all the way. And then we'll just put a red in there. The repeaters are just there to make sure more than anything. Okay, so we go back down the bottom here. Now we need a button and we need a lever. So have I got either? Probably not. Probably not. Let's make a button. I like stone buttons better than wooden buttons, so I'm going to keep with my stone button. And a lever. Boop, boop. And let's put that there and there. Now this one is the lever. And that one's the button. So if we do this. I heard them. Did they all come down? Did all of them come down? Excellent, they did. Okay, so that should be now pretty much safe for cows to be in. Let's just uh, close all this off again. Like that. Perfect. So they shouldn't be able to get out anywhere. No, it's all good. Okay, and then it's the important one. In fact, let's put some blocks here. And if they get washed down, we know that we've got it right. In fact, I'll probably go up and have a look anyway. Uh, and button. I've already put it down. Button. Let's have a look. It's got to go all the way. I fired it. Lovely. Perfect. And all our stuff is on the way down there, including our our torches, which isn't something great. Put the torches up here. <laughs> there. There. Just to keep it a little bit more friendlier. Lucky the pistons were down. I would have died. Where's my beef? Oh, just in time. Look, we've got one piece of beef left. Uh, swim. Oh, it's really hard to swim without being able to bob along. And I'm not going down that way. No chance. No siree. I haven't tested this with water in yet to see if I can get up. Uh, we're good. Phew. Okay, so now we can come back down here, push the button again, and the water will stop. Now, we will have this on a, on a loop, so it sort of fires it and stops it together, uh, which we'll probably do next. In fact, oh yeah, all the items are going to burn, weren't they, through the lava. Like I didn't put anything important there, wasn't it? Phew. I forgot about the lava there. Okay, so now let's just quickly work on something that we can turn off and on or we can sort of make it fire twice if you know what I mean uh, oh no uh, we're gonna break that there uh, we'll just have a very simple quick clock um, there's my hidden chest with nothing in it uh, break oh I, I don't know why I always have hidden chests at the beginning of games where I keep my diamonds and emeralds and stuff like that as you can see there was nothing nothing even in it um, when I moved everything down here and I was like Wait a minute, why have we got a secret chest when I'm on a single player world? In Minecadia, I think I had about four or five hidden chests about on Minecadia. And uh, no one ever found any of them. Well, no, I tell a lie, someone found one of them. Um, but it was a hidden chest that I, what did I used to keep in that one? Wool. I used to keep uh, wool in it, because uh, wool was really hard to come by. So it was sort of something that everybody really wanted. Um, right, we're going to have to do a little bit of moving and shoving here. Let's... Take that away. That'll still fire. We need to have uh, four or five. How many repeaters do we want? 
I don't really know. We're gonna need some more stuff. Anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six repeaters will do, I think. And what we'll do is we're gonna have. It needs to fire once. That's gonna fire it once. And then we need to go through a set of repeaters. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope, that's not going to work. Let's um, have that there, that there, and that there. So then it fires it. It goes once, twice. Perfect. That'll work. So let's put all of these on maximum delay at first to see how long that's going to give us. So now when we press the button, it fires once, and it fires twice. Now that wasn't very long. Oh, wait a minute. That's not what we want. We don't want that. We want another repeater. Right there. <laughs> I think it's, it's firing the water so many times at the top here at the minute. Uh, okay, we'll put, repeat it there. And then that'll solve that problem. Done. Problem solved. Okay, now is the water on or is the water off? I have absolutely no idea. And I want to invert that torch as well. The first torch. Okay, so it's off. Perfect. Uh, let me just invert this torch. Because I don't like the torch being down. I was saying this the other day. I don't like the torch being down. Um, when the levers are up, it's sort of backwards, and I don't like it. So let's go through here. Go up here. Uh, uh. It's not going to take two seconds, guys. Um, and then... Uh, what's the easiest way to do this? I don't know what the easiest way, sort of the simplest way to do it, if you guys want to do it yourself. Probably... That might work. That might work. I'm not 100% sure. Let's have a look. Can we hear it? Yep. So now the piston should be up. Hopefully. If we've got it right, the piston should be up now. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to leave it. Damn thing. Woo. Woo, I'm glitching out. What happened there? Oh, is it because I'm placing redstone underneath it? I don't know. Let's do something wrong. Okay, now what was I doing? Oh yeah, the repeaters. We're going to need uh, some more delay on it, I think. So let's get some more repeaters going. Uh, I need some more sticks. One, two, boop. One, two, boop. One, two, boop. That'll do. Three more repeaters. And we can place these in... Oh, god damn it, that's the edge. Okay, we're going to come round then. Um, uh, one, two... Oh, I don't know. Um... <laughs> Let's take that away. Uh, 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 uh. Damn it, this is just. Oh, just make it bigger. Just make it bigger. Eh, 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 eh. Boop, boop. Come here. One, two, three. Excellent. One, two, three. Perfect. Get the redstone. Nope. Get the redstone. Hook that up. Hook that up. Put the delays on these ones. Okay, now we should be a bit of a longer delay now. Okay, we'll see how long that is. We don't want it super long, because if we have it too long, all the cows come down, and we lose all the cows, and then we can't breed them. We just want to push it enough so that most of the cows come down, but we leave a few up there. And it's sort of trusting a little bit to luck, really. But it's basically done. How we're going to get them in there is another thing. Maybe we should just do a staircase. Am I going to need another pickaxe? Yes, I am. Let's make another pickaxe. And then... Oh, and get some wheat. All right, I'll tell you what, guys. I'm going to make another pickaxe. Grow a bit of wheat quickly. Um, and build a staircase up so we can get the cows straight in there. It's going to be less hassle then, isn't it? Okay, I'll be right back. Oh, and bones to grow the wheat with. Bones, bones, bones. Okay, I'm at the surface, but it's night time. So I thought I'd come back. We just need um, just need a seed. Or a couple of seeds, really. And then I'll, I'll collect them off. I think next episode we might build a sort of wheat farm. Maybe if, if I can come up with something cool for a wheat farm. Um, 
we do we, we'll just use the wheat for breeding you see so we don't need an absolutely massive system because we're not going to be using it for bread we're going to use beef as our main food supply as it's just the best food and this is most readily available for us at the moment there we go there's some seeds okay ah oh, damn it we need a hoe don't we as well to grow them ah oh. <laughs> there don't swear <laughs> running out over time you see as well I'm, I've, I've got to get things done it just takes so long to build some things, doesn't it? It's looking really cool, though. That adds a little bit of light in here as well. Um, just make a stone hoe. Perfect. That's all we need. All we need. Ah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Down to our last piece of beef. This isn't great. That's the wrong one. Boop, 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 boop. Hup. And go. Go, I'm going to save this beef, in fact, because we might need it. <laughs> Oh, I'll get some cows going first before I start killing them all. Okay, so let's um, put that down there. Oh, no. Get away from me. I chucked my hoe. You made me scared that much. Okay, we've got some more bones at least. Uh, uh. Boop, boop. With the bone meal. Ah, uh, bone meal. Boop, boop. I always do two. I always forget that you get three from each one. Uh-huh. Perfect. Okay, that'll do. I plant that one down. And we've well, got some wheat. Let where where I make the entrance way? There it is. That goes straight down to the cow farm. So let's get some cows. We've got one here and one here. Come here. Oi, you. Look, 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 look at the wheat. No, not the sheep. Hi cow. Oh god damn it, cow, you okay? God damn it, there's gotta be another cow around here somewhere. Not too far. They're all miles away. Yeah, I see you, cow. Hello, how's it going? Do you mind getting right in my face? Okay, let's go get this cow over here. Uh, stay there, cow. Don't go anywhere. Come here. Not the sheep, though. Don't want the sheep. Not yet. We will be getting a sheep farm. We'll be getting uh, a sheep cut farm for sure. Uh, if we can get some really cool sort of sheep set up. Uh, that'd be bonus. No, don't come into the water. Oh, and there's another damn cow here now. Where'd you come from? Huh? Where'd you come from? Okay. And down we come. Can you see me? Come on. Come on. Come on. One. Come on. Cow. Cow. Come on. You're nearly there. You're down. Excellent. Have you got you both? Okay, we got you both still. I can't see the damn other cow behind him. Okay, you're still there. Both of you are still here. All we need is two, and then I can breed the rest. Come on. Come on. Oh, I can kill the ones up the top there as well, can't I? Okay, so we're down. Out the way, sheep. Okay, sheep, you're dying. You didn't get out of the way. I gave you a chance. You could have lived up here for a short amount of time. Uh, let's see this piece of beef, though. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to sprint soon. All right, now I want to... Breed you. Now you should be fine. Yeah, hello little cow. Um, should we try and get some more down here? Let me go. And, let me get some more down here. I'll be right back. I'm gonna play about and get as many as I can from up here down to there. Okay, be right back. All right. So I got another two, and then I got scared. <laughs> it's night time, and I'm scared up there now. So uh, we're gonna leave it there. Uh, boop, boop. We'll leave the staircase there in case we want some more though. We've got a sheep down here as well. We've got two babies and four adults. I don't really want to risk tr testing it out yet. Um, or should we? Um, no, I'm going to let the cow farm get bigger. We'll test it out in a few episodes once we we'll sort of bred it up. We need to get a wheat system going as well. Uh, and then we'll test it out. If I get any any beef down here that we don't that fell through. <laughs> uh, what's this hoppers there? We can sort of set this on a automatic timer maybe or something. I don't know. We'll think of something. Uh, but that's going to do it for this episode, guys. We've got our cool little cow farm set up. Um, I'm going to breed as madly as I can off camera between now and next episode. Uh, so maybe we can get to see it in action next episode and see how effective it is. Uh, but until then, we're going to leave it there. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And we shall see you in the next episode. Bye!